Now watch carefully. As soon as the snake charges, the serval takes a giant leap backward. She swiftly predicts the snake's next move and reacts quickly. The serval always places most of her weight on her lower body so that she can jump back at any time. Here too, the lower body's strength necessary for jumps takes on significance. Now, here comes the real battle. The serval throws the punch. And there's another one. She uses her valuable punching skills. Body attack. The serval is working on her timing. Her strategy is to begin with an attack on the body and slowly weaken the snake. The snake is moving away from the serval. A blow to the head. Oh, watch out! The snake still has some fighting spirit in it. The serval carefully waits for its chance to strike. Oh, did the snake get her? Ooh, that was close. Now what's her next move? She moves around the snake. A blow to the head. Well, that did the trick. The snake stops moving. The serval moves in and throws a punch. Another. And another. Cat punch. Oh, an amazing move. Here's why. After dodging the snake's attack by lifting her two front paws, the serval used her raised left paw to strike the snake's head. That caused the snake's head to violently hit the ground. Now comes a series of punches. Take that! And that! The serval grabs the snake's head and... Game over! She